Nathan McSweeney is a top-order Australian batsman that has moved into pole positioning for the opening batsman slot at the top of the order in the upcoming Border Gavaskar Trophy. With all eyes on him in the lead-up to the Big Test Series, here we'll be analysing his batting technique. McSweeney typically sets up with an open stance, with the back foot on middle and front foot outside leg. As the bowler is in their delivery stride, he has a small movement back from the back foot. Just as the ball is released, he steps the front foot across and down the line of leg. From this position, depending on the length, he'll move forward or back. On this occasion, he gets onto the front foot and drives through the offside. McSweeney is a confident driver of the ball through the offside. From his base position, after the initial trigger where he moves the back foot back and then front foot onto leg, he spots the length and then begins to get a big stride out to the ball. Using the bend for the back knee, he gets low onto the drive. We can see at the point of contact he has excellent weight and balance into the shot. With the head, bat and body pointing in the general direction, he wants to hit the ball. As he completes the drive, we can see the bottom hand is in control as the bat face is closed. In this next example, we see McSweeney's skill in manipulating the ball into the gap when driving. As mentioned earlier, he has a trigger back on middle. The front foot follows onto leg as the ball is released. As he spots the full length, he gets a big stride out to the ball and he positions himself to drive through the offside. Using the bend of the knees, he keeps low and carries the momentum forward into the shot. On this occasion, we see how he opens the face of the bat to hit the gap square of the wicket on the offside. As expected, like many Australian batsmen, McSweeney is a dominant player of the short ball. After his initial trigger back into the crease, and as the ball pitches short, he has eyes on the length. After the ball is pitched, he has the bat in a high position ready to pull from high to low. He also begins to bend the back knee in that same motion. He uses the bend of the back knee to rotate the hips and stand tall, from which he easily pivots on the ball. In the second example, after McSweeney's slight back and across trigger, he spots the length and has the bat in a high position. The back knee begins to bend, which is key to him getting leverage through the shot. He bends the knees and uses the back knee to open and rotate the hips. He pivots off the back foot in one motion and once again pulls the ball comfortably. 